Okay, so today we're going to be doing a quick unboxing of the G-Skill Falcon 2. So this is a SATA 2, 2.5 inch solid state drive like most of the other SSDs out on the market. It is faster than a hard drive and it is also more power efficient and more reliable, etc, etc. So enjoy your quiet, fast, cool, reliable and power efficient G-Skill solid state drives. This particular drive is rated for 220 megabytes per second reads and 110 megabytes per second writes, but that's not actually the most important spec. The most important thing is the random read and random write performance of an SSD, and this one uses the Indolinks barefoot controller, so that means that you're going to see performance similar to other Indolinks based drives, such as the OCZ Vertexes or the Corsair X series. So the Falcon 2 comes in a little padded black book shape thing so we open it up here and let's see what we get for accessories we get a piece of paper so this is a user guide and the user guide says, oh I love this installation nice you'd think the user guide was written by Nvidia I think that's very funny anyway it gives you a general idea of the specs and the installation procedure for your drive and that is pretty much it and then you get the oh oh no there's something else but wait there's more attention for firmware upgrade use only, actually this is a really interesting thing to talk about because G-Skill Falcon 2 drives, you can update the firmware much like many of the other Indolinks drives in order to get better performance sometimes as well as new features. So many of the Indolinks drives on the market these days have actually been updated to add trim support. So trim is a very important feature supported by Windows 7 that allows your solid state drive to perform in a like new uh, level of performance even after it has been used because with the early SSDs you'd actually see a significant performance degradation over time as you filled it up. So here is the drive itself. We can start at the back where we have the SATA 2 power as well as our SATA 2 data interface and you can see these two little pins right here are exactly where that jumper would go when you follow the correct procedure to update the firmware. And then on the back of the drive, you can see we got our Rojas, it's two and a half, it uh, reaffirms the spec. So it has a 64 meg onboard cache, much like most of the Indolinks drives on the market. Okay, you've got your four mounting holes down here at the bottom, as well as your four mounting holes on either side. So this drive can be installed in probably about 99% of notebooks out there that accept a two and a half inch drive. You've got a nice sort of matte black finish on the top of the drive with a G-Skill Falcon sticker. Thank you for checking out my unboxing of the G-Skill Falcon two.